Eli Iserbeet, winner here at World Cup uh, Jingle Cross. Uh, you made a move uh, kind of at the top of Mount Crumpet. Did you have that spot picked out? Yeah, um, I knew I was in the advantage because I'm 55 kilos, so <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that big. And um, turned it a very high pace in the in the beginning of the level uh, of the race. I'm sorry, and um, yeah, I think it was just at the at the end of his his, his Latin because um, on top I I heard he was coughing and and I think he was bit doing over over his level and um, yeah, I took advantage of that in the descent and I got a, a little gap and I just uh, kept my pace and that was enough. Looks like you were feeling really good out there. How were the legs feeling today? Well, the legs were really good. Uh, I worked really, really hard this summer and um, yeah, it, was, it was a very hard summer for me as well. But I knew Mathieu Wout um, didn't start these races so I really wanted to take advantage of that and I think that's worked out pretty well. <laughs> Uh, new to the elites, uh, yeah. first elite world, uh, first World Cup as an elite. Did that uh, add some special meaning uh, to this race for you? Um, well, I was here since two years ago. Um, I only did uh, American races, mm -hmm. World Cup races with elite. So I knew the course and I knew it would be really hard. Um, I, I, we talked about it with the team, and you had just to keep a steady pace the whole race and not blowing up in the beginning. And I think I did that really well. And yeah. Worked out uh, nicely. Well, cool. Well, congratulations, and we'll see you next weekend in Waterloo. Thank you.